Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Infection Free Zone. Today's beverage is a very standard, albeit reliable, cup of tea. The good old cup, are hopefully good for infected uh, horde defense because we do have quite a number coming towards us right now. I wasn't going to do a, um, another episode. This was supposed to be just a standalone, but I've been enjoying it so much. I thought, hey, we'll do a, at least a, one more follow up to see how we get on. Anyway, we can see the guys are coming in there, and not only are our guys in the warehouse shooting, but also the tower. Now, the tower has got considerably less health than most buildings. Oh, I see. Actually, maybe not. I actually got. Um, it's actually got twice as much as this building. Interesting. Anyway, looks like these um, guys are swarming the tower. The tower is taking a fair amount of damage. This one also a similar thing. I'm going to um, bring our other guys out and in, into this one so they can support the tower. Um, there we go. Hopefully they'll be able, yeah, they'll be able to fire there. So this first tower, uh, no resources, pistol. Yeah, we're out of, we've only got one pistol, sadly. Um, but... Can we maybe get those guys in here to try and stave off the inevitable collapse of this wooden tower? Because it's going down, and it's going down at a much higher rate than I expected. Um, slowing down now that we're taking out the uh, the horde. We'll have to repair this tomorrow morning, assuming it's still in one piece, which I don't think it will be. But uh, this is still in the... This is not even uh, past midnight yet. And then we've got even more horde spotted here. Um, maybe, Operator. maybe put those guys in this building, and then Waiting those guys in that building go. again. Yeah, we'll just have to micromanage uh, some of the movements here. Like I said, I'm not too worried about the ones from this side because you've got a tower that's pretty much, uh, pretty much okay. Um, and then obviously these buildings as well. Uh, well, they're fine, I guess. But this is a, a, a very, very big um, horde that we're seeing here and then that one's gone i wonder if it's specific like is it the darkest part at night no it's not it's not like it says not the darkest uh, uh time but no it's just overcast anyway we've got another horde coming in 13 dominant type humans here everyone's in this building just to support uh the tower once they're inside they're obviously inside. The, uh, the shots ring out and pretty much deal with this horde in short order there's one down the bottom there, this one tower is, ooh, it's on about 25% health. What else can you have, actually? You've got assault rifles, you've got shotguns, and a sniper rifle. Obviously, sniper, is, you really want to place it in here to get a good view overlooking things. Um, we can't uh, really change things at this stage. Oh, it looks like uh, these guys would benefit from moving into this building, so we'll just do a bit of micromanagement. I don't know if it's um, a good idea to have them outside when the attack's going on like that. That was a bit too close for for comfort, that one, but we are able to take out that, and there they go. It does say that the sun rises at 5.28, and we're on 4.05, and just having a look around. More horde over here. Um, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what the population of the Isle of Butte is, but <laughs> I'm guessing at some point the game... Like, yeah, someone's done the calculations and said, well, actually, <laughs> the population is X and they've killed like five times as many. Did they just travel here because they wanted to? I don't know. Oh, got another car over there as well, which is good. Um, yeah, we got another horde spotted, but quite frankly, I'm not too concerned now because the sun is up, so we're going to start to scavenge once again. And I'm going to say for this one, I want to repair. For this thing, I want to repair. For this thing, I want to repair. It's all going to take wood, but that's not too much of a problem. Let me get back into the vehicle and we're going to have another scavenge. We are okay for food. Um, it's actually weapons that we're short of, so we're going to take a bit of a we're going to take a bit of a drive, I think, to anywhere that we can potentially get weapons. Oh, uh, uniformed services facility, police uh, high stop. It's a police station. Oh well, let's go. Let's get squad one going. So all these are getting repaired. We're still chopping down this. Uh, we're still waiting for trees, actually, but whatever. Um, we are chopping that down and um, building here, although. Do we have the tools? It says basic tools. We are... Oh, we have nine basic tools, so I think we probably can. But yes, I am going to look for weapons, I think. For for, for buildings, though, like wooden palisades, I wonder how... I wonder how, like... Oh, look at that metal gate, uh, gates and such. 
Hmm. Interesting. Going there. How much uh, resource would we get if we just demolish this? Uh, ooh, a lot. Okay. <laughs> Sir, the winter is coming. Winter is coming, the yes. The will be shorter. The farms won't produce any more food. We should brace hmm. ourselves. This might be the hardest days of the year. Prepare for winter. So the Let's farms won't do any, uh, give us any more food, which is handy because we're just about to finish the farms. <laughs> we're literally just about to finish the farms and yes, well, happy days. Anyway, over to scavenging and to gather metals. And I want to gather some metal here. And uh, there's a couple of street lights and things like that. Uh, the reason we're doing that is because we need to build the tower. And we'll say do Let's that. Do so, building complete, and... Oh, they're coming back with the car. Oh, is that six ammo? I think it is. And any weapons? Didn't seem to alter, which is a shame. So, back to the car. And... You know what? Just load the vehicle up. Load the vehicle up. Is that a little statue there? It is. Uh, Chapel Hill Road. Butte and Cowell Vets, Isle Guile Street, that's Regal Palace, so some of these might have a name, some of them may not, Dean Hood Place, the Fine Group, uh, how are we doing for this, load up the car, there you go, so they're loading the car up, which is good. And let's continue. Uh, oh, so let's uh, let's continue searching. Basically, that's done. All right. So the farm is now in, which is good. I want a cookhouse. I'm going to make this a cookhouse. I think, and this can be a cookhouse. And say there. All right. We're going to crack on with that. Uh, is no one assigned to this one? Um, assigned two workers to that. So. And after building a research centre and do a basic, I'm gonna have to have this one as a research centre, aren't I? I don't, I don't have to have this one as a research centre, but I mean, I am gonna have it as a research centre. And then for a tower, we we only have really one weapon, an assault rifle. Where is the next port of call? Are they still scavenging that? Are they stuck? I think they might have been stuck. We've got food there, food there, food there, and There's nothing left. what time's sunset? 6.56. I reckon they can search that building out, and then they can get the car Operator. and drive it back, assuming it's got some fuel in, which I think they all do by default, but I'm not entirely sure of that, <laughs> truth be told. No anyway, to building clear. Have they got anything? Uh, oh, they must have done. Yes, they do. Uh, so it's full, so they, ha they have to go back to drop it off in this warehouse. So we are producing some just grain by the look of it, which is fine. Um, no more do I need any more builders? Going there. Mm, let's max on scavengers. I've just got some members, of, some are unemployed. And, wow, look at that. So this car is just full of ammo and canned food and all sorts. Um, night time at 18.56. we got about an hour to get to that vehicle and drive back. So I'm not overly concerned. I don't know how long it takes to rip that street light down, but apparently quite a bit. Um, yeah, we're heading over here. Still only got the one ammo. Where's the next place to search next time? Um, there. Uniform, a uh, school. There's a school over here. Which apparently you can find ammunition, pistol, and assault rifle. We've got a, another building here. Chief, we just found a dead animal. But the mm -hmm. thing is, it was literally shredded to pieces. Oh. It couldn't just be some ordinary infected. There are teeth marks on its skin. They look like dog teeth. Okay. Stay alert. So, oh, are we going to get a different type of horde? Yes, yes we are. And I don't know where. My concern is getting these guys back in time. I actually thought they would have been um, 
back a lot quicker. And let's go. Let's do it. But they're on the road. And uh, yes, they will happily mow down any infected. <laughs> Hostiles inbound. Sorry, I read that name wrong. This is Michelle Jackson, uh, Roy Moore, Logan Miller, and Catherine Murphy. Waiting orders. Let's uh, occupy... Well, they've occupied Operator. that building, which is fine. We're building the cookhouse, although it's sort of probably pointless at this stage. Maybe. I don't know. Is it pointless? Because, uh, do we have raw resources of some kind? Uh, not really. Oh, yeah, we do. This thing here, food rations. Is it, um, I was going to say, it's not sunny, so I don't know what's going on there. I'm just going to zoom out a bit and do max speed. I am tempted to demolish that building. Oh, there's some doggos. Heads up, there are some infected dogs incoming fast. Oh, okay. Um, engage, Shoot I guess. Them down. So let's get these guys outside and then in here. I'm tempted for another maybe defensive position there, but there's no point if this one doesn't even have ammo. Um, so lots of doggos coming in. There's 12 dogs. Uh, 987. Uh, three, two, yeah, okay, that's that, that's not lasting long at all. Oh, don't say these are going to go around Reporting. this way. Yeah, that's exactly what's going to happen. They're going to engage. Oh, hang on. Oh, coming around the corner. Are they going to go for the cookhouse? Potentially, but I think if we get one shot off, they'll come to us. To oh, the tower's shooting. Oh, and so are we. Let's get in a better Waiting position. Orders. Bit of micromanagement. Move, move, move. Get hustle. At least these are nice, nice and repaired now, which is good. Would it be best going with two bone arrows as opposed to one pistol? Um, the damage would be increased, but the range reduced by five meters. So I don't know. So there's a horde incoming, but I don't see where. When in doubt, I'm going to split these up. Oh yeah, there's infected over there. At least we've got two cars now. So I think tomorrow... Our priority is going to be gather metal and basically zoom to anywhere that you can get ammo from. Is there anything a bit closer? No. It says there's something over here, like unknown. Lots of open areas. No, not there. Yeah, just around here. Straight down this road, straight down the high street, I think. Blast down the high street. That's what we'll do. Um, I mean, I'm tempted to go now, but is it worth the risk? I don't think it is. But we'll definitely use both cars. Uh, fuel is okay for both of them. Which is fine. It's, uh, it's going to be 557 for Sunrise. For research, we do want to get basic antenna, but we've also, also got med centers, you've got chemistry for fertilizers, you've got arms production, you've got tools factories, farming and food and food preservation, things like that. We've got uh, oh, not enough scientific materials to start the research. No, no we haven't. Ready for action. And it's paused for some reason. I'm paused, probably because I've been looking in that menu. Up to building into a med bay. Well, I will if I actually have it unlocked first. But we're going to get the cookhouse. And we've also, almost anyway, got the tower. I don't know where I'm going to place the tower. Maybe here? Doesn't really matter too much, I'm guessing. And then maybe putting some walls across. Because we can build barriers. So walls across here. Gate. Wall. Gate. Well, wall. Gate. Straight across. Rising grind. And uh, straight down, and uh, I'm tempted to demolish like these parts of the buildings. Anyway, everyone's getting out, out and about. Um, so you, you can go in there. You can go in there. This guy can start the search in here, and the other team can start the search there. So there you go. It's going to be a bit of a <laughs> bit of a scrappy race. Here we go, and yeah, I don't think I've travelled that quick, that close to them buildings. Actually, they just went through a building, so there you go. But it's going to be a bit of a task to search. Are these guys actually producing? Yes, they are. They are producing. Good. At least if we get one pistol, that would help, I'm hoping. Cookhouse is 
getting built. We also need to get a research center and mm -hmm. research basic uh, antenna. So are we going to have this as the research center? Mm. Yeah, go on, why not? We'll have them along here. And these buildings, because they're quite small, we can probably demolish a lot of these. Um, like demolishing these, you get a fair amount off it. Um, yeah. Okay, well, demolish. 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 Clear. And demolish. Building clear. Roger. That's all done. And you know what? Go over there. On my way. What's this here? Building... Mast. Huge flagpole represents our fearless people. I mean, we could place it. It costs 20 metal. I mean, is there any point in me building it? Area cleared. It looks cool. We're building it. <laughs> Area clear. They have... We need to bring all this stuff back to the car. Lots of ammo. But again, no pistols. Roger. No. That's not fully searched out. That's why. I don't know why I've uh, told them to do that. It's not fully searched out. Okay, fine. So back over. You can see these buildings here are being demolished. Do we have any people that are unemployed? Only two. Just max out the builders then. Or, actually, what does it say for builders? Are these a builder task? I don't know. Signed workers. There's nothing left. Going there. Not there sure. Oh, hang on. The car's coming back. Which means this is it now empty, yes? But the car's normally full. Reporting. Yep, it's full of ammo. <laughs> we don't have anything to fire it out of, but it's definitely full of ammo. <laughs> okay. Well, they're going to dump that in the warehouse. Lots to crack on with. And is the car empty? It is. Operator. Right, get back in the vehicle. And you guys can go over here this time. Roger. Oh, finally, we found a pistol. Good. That's what we want. How are we doing for these things? Yeah, I, I would have thought scavengers take the buildings down. Which I'm guessing they do. No path to there? I'm going to say, really? Ready for action. Don't think that's the case. Anyway, these guys are loading all of this stuff in the vehicle. And don't say, is the vehicle full? It is. Wow. But they've left the pistol behind, because of course they have. Uh, currently, uh, we're on uh, half two. Sunset is 1817. There we are. That car's doing the donuts. <laughs> it's doing some donuts. Oh, brilliant. Is that complete now? It is. I wonder if it gives you bonuses. Oh, no. I thought it would give you, like, positive mood or something. That would be nice. Anyway, we're going to go back in the car, and we're going to go and pick up the remaining ammo and pistol that is there, so we can at least arm that up. And I would like another tower, but we don't have the option. Oh, wait. We now have, yes, cookhouse. So it turns two wheat and one wood into four just generic f units of food, I'm guessing. Some sustenance. Good. Right, those guys. Going there. Uh, dump that in your car. Dump that in your car. Then you can search that out. Yeah, there you go. You might as well have a look while you're here. Um, sunset is uh, actually... It's short. Waiting no, orders. It's short. Sunset's very... Well, close to it anyway. I'm going to just search this out quickly. This other, Use this other squad to search this small building. And search done. we're getting back. Yeah, we're going to get back home. Let's do it. These guys, get back in your car. And get back. Let's do it. And back on the same road. Oh, look at the headlights come on. That's a nice touch. And there's the infected there. So, we're coming back. And actually... We might be able to get the pistol to him. I say, I don't actually know who's in there. Are they armed with every a pistol? Or is the stuff still in the car? No, it's fine. Yeah, there we go. So no longer are they short of a pistol. Good. All right. We've got some infected. 
over there. And the hordes are only getting gonna get bigger, aren't they, really? Yeah. Build it to build it building into a med bay and adapt to building into a research center. We're still working on the research center part. We got one unemployed, and I'm, I'm gonna assume it is builders. Um sorry, scavengers for the for this, and it looks like that to be that is the case, yes. So once again, tomorrow morning, um, we're going to head out straight away over to this left-hand side. We're only 49% searched on this left-hand building, and we've got um, we've got this scientific materials. We've got more scientific materials. Lots of unknowns around here. There's medicine. Let's have a look on the uh, right-hand side. We haven't really had a look here. Lots of buildings in this lovely windy road. Uh, lots of food across here. I don't think food is necessarily going to be the issue that we have um lots of wood if we ever need it as well and over here more food yeah so basically what i'm hearing is we need to get manufacturing if we're playing long term i mean although it's uh, currently september so these stop growing when fields prepares the area so that it's suitable for growing vegetables. Yes. But depends on when you can grow vegetables. Oh, hang on. We have Horde coming in. Let me just reposition these guys. So now we have at least twice the firepower on this, plus all of the guys in here. Um, so I'm not really too concerned about the wooden tower. Oh, there's still ones coming in as well. Wow. They dealt with those completely is good. Yeah, another couple more. Hardly even reached the tower. Good. Alright. Well, we'll just see if we can get through the night quickly. Like I say, tomorrow morning, jumping straight back in the car and heading out. Another horde. Uh, I think I'll reposition so one of them's in the middle. We have one assault rifle and one pistol so I couldn't even set up another Ready for action. yeah I couldn't even set up another uh -oh, that's bad <laughs> um, yeah another squad you can have up to four squads by the look of it let me get these guys on the road actually I'll get around the corner Ooh, I'm gonna get inside I think we got hurt yeah a little bit of damage there when you get caught out of a building it's not not uh, not ideal all right, let's get going. So, on the road again, and we are searching for that. And this one. Should we search for... I mean, this is unknown in this one here. Let's search that then. Why not? And keeping the guys together is probably a good idea. Is it? Don't know. <laughs> Incoming transmission. Oh, survivors. Um, ah, spot some people. Probably, probably armed. They could have seen us too. I can't tell if they're friendly. Well, approach friendly. Approach them friendly. With our car. Have a little drive over. Now then, how are you doing? Let's do it. How is everything? Roger. Well, they're not open and fire or anything, so I'm hoping that they're friendly. Three group members. Just search the building here. Oh! They've turned hostile. Oh, there's a bit of damage on Michelle and on Logan. Uh, we have managed to take them out, but not without consequence. Two days to recover. I think that's just in general, if we had a med bay, it's quicker, but we haven't even researched it yet. Anyway. Clear. Oh, found a pistol. Which is good. Roger. So, they're just gonna... Oh, they found... Ah! So, we've actually taken out... Ah, right, that makes sense. We've taken out the people that attacked us, and we've gained some ammunition and such. Hmm, that does make sense, to be fair. Right, let's have a search of this big building. Uh, over here, we found ammo, nothing else. We were going to go to this part because it says unknown. But 
it just says the tile. Does it mean all the way around here or specifically that building? I actually don't know. Anyway, zooming in, a lot of these buildings are almost demolished, which is good. I'm going to go with a building of a wooden tower, which is going to go... Oh, there's a hostile there. The wooden tower is going to go here, so it can overlook this road, which is fine. They're searching that out. There's nothing there. Let's just search all of this. It's going to take quite a while to search this big building, but no matter. This research centre is uh, getting built. Do we have any more workers? We can max out some builders, get some more people building. Why not? So we've got two towers there. Do we have do we want another one around here? Not really, because they have to come towards this, so it's not really a problem. At least I don't see it as one. Receiving. These guys are... Receiving. Stuck. <laughs> they do seem to do that from time to time. They searched it out, but then they didn't move on. How curious. Search done. Ready Search done. Action. No, they're coming back and not in the car. Yeah, I think you'll get in the car, thank Receiving. you. <laughs> Receiving. Receiving. Yeah, back in the car. Adaptation done. And, oh, research basic antenna technology. So, it's communication, basic antenna, start research. I'm going to tell those guys Receiving. to search that. Because why not? So there's that. Lots of assigned workers. And do we have the wood for this? Three of ten. Oh, we have loads of wood because we're demolishing the buildings. So suppose you're chopping the trees down. We're just uh, removing the the buildings, as it were. I think once you've searched out a certain part, you can like literally send out expeditions out to this sort of hazy bit. Oh, apparently we can search the sea, can we? <laughs> hmm. Income transmission. Now we're ready to build an antenna. Once it's operational, we'll be ready to receive distant transmissions again and broadcast some invitations ourselves. Okay, so we can build an antenna. Um, well, let's, I guess. I'm going to build it uh, there. Stop working. Start winding down. Okay, let's do this. So that does take let's a bit to build. It. Also, research-wise, then, do we have any... Oh, no, we have no research points. That's a shame. Looks like the car's also completely full there. Um, sunset is... Oh, it's actually close to sunset. So these guys... Uh, I'll probably let them crack on, because they're not too far away. Oh, they're on... No, sadly, they're, they're a bit too... They're a bit too uh, exposed at this stage. Let me just... Yeah, you just come back. So you can go in that building. That guy can come back. I'm probably going to put them in this building, actually. So there you go. And they're just going to dump all that stuff in our storage. And then I'll say, you can defend that. Because if anything comes from this way, they've got two buildings, the cookhouse and the research centre, that we can't do anything with. What was that? What's that? Yes. There must be hundreds of them. I have a bad feeling about this. Okay. Um, get ready. Okay. Get ready to defend the zone. So we have a big, big attack coming, I think. Pretty sure that's what that symbolizes. Um, Research-wise, we need to do a med bay, and a med bay would cost two research points. We don't have any. I think I can get them. There's a one there and one there. Like a place to search. So we'll see. Unpause the game though because yeah it's about to kick off and my question is are they going to come from all directions? And if so what am I going to do about it? Not much we can do. How many builders do I have actually? Um, four builders. None's assigned to this. Are they all assigned to that? Yeah, they are. Wow, okay. 
Mm, it's because we got like food prep and got like got, uh, scientists and such. I'm gonna reduce the amount of scientists. We just literally don't need any scientists um, at the moment, do we? Like I don't think I don't think you need any of that. Research research time forty hours to do that. All right, fine. So someone's been assigned to that one. I'm just going to max this out. And, oh, maybe I won't. Right. There's the infected coming in here. And which way are they going to go? I have a feeling they're going to come towards this tower. In which case, we need to spot that tower. So I'm bringing both of our teams. And I'm tempted to get a third. Can't create a new squad. Yeah, no workers idle. If I had some more people, I would be able to arm them up. Anyway. I feel like that tower's gone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, that tower is that tower's going down. There's no way. There's more hard spotted. Oh my good grief! There's loads coming in. Right, get moving over. That tower's gonna have to deal with it. I mean, that one's almost gone. Right, let's get these guys moved over. The tower's gonna have to deal with it. The one or two that's left. There's two of them because they're coming from our main base. Yes, they are. So they are whacking at the side of the building. I mean, we're taking them down. More horde spotted in... Oh, there's hostile enemies as well. We definitely don't need that. Where are these guys going? They're going to come towards that tower, aren't they? <laughs> oh, no, they're not. They're going to go to our research center, I think. Or the cookhouse or something. I'm just going to get our people in this so they can overlook around. If this building was gone, we'd have a much better line of sight, but, well, we don't. Um, I'm just going to check to see the line of sight of this is. Oh, it's actually really good. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, I think that tower will be going down. And there's some more horde down the bottom. I wonder if we can, like, repair now. Well, we can click repair, but I... It won't do anything. What time are we on? Uh, three, three forty. Sunrise is at pretty much seven. Okay. Well, I mean, if we can hold out for the next couple of hours, we might be okay. Shows us just how not good the towers are. Repair. Ah, oh, and if you repair them, the guys leave it. Right, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> I mean, at least we'll this you know the the guys will survive hopefully. But five, we've only got a couple more hours. We might get through this. Receiving. Going I'm gonna there. get these guys in the vehicle. There's a horde. Because I want these to drive as soon as we can. Because we're just going to get these research materials. So we're going to bomb along to here. Grab that. Bomb along to here. Grab that. Oh! Oh, I didn't realise it goes oh, this way. Oh, I was looking at this box here. Oh, we've got all of down here as well. Like medical centres and such. Yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> we started at this tile. Let's, would have st start on the left of help. I don't know. Right, I think they've actually gone to sleep, you know. I'm getting them going. I think they've held I think they're all held up in the building. Yeah, people are getting out. Right. Boss, it's been a rough night. Something must have made the infected extremely bloodthirsty. Yeah. If more and more come, our ch chances will be really uh will be really low. We will prevail. We'll get over this. We have to. We're all that's we left of humanity. Up. That and the uh, other hostiles that are wandering around. Right, so back to farming. Uh, oh, it's actually November, so I don't think these will be doing anything. Although, it seems to be doing something. So we're in the, we're in the car, and... Raiders? Are coming. Get ready. Raiders? Doesn't say where. Anyway, we're going to go to this place. Because this it. is research material. Uh, what's this? No path. Well, they are building it, so... <laughs> yeah, we keep on bumping into those hostiles there. 
just two group me group members. What I might do is gather up. Yeah, we might gather up and go from there. Hmm. Incoming transmission. Chief, I've been looking around more recently. And I'm thinking everything's turning green. Pure. We're not the masters of this world anymore. What do you mean? What do you mean by that? Branches sticking out of windows and roots breaking through. No more to As if the forest itself has come to reclaim the land. Reporting. And all these animals around downtown, Raiders it's their spotted. world now. On my and way. the infected. We'll get them. Uh. We're under attack! Okay, so I'm just going to engage these guys in the car. We will reclaim it. Can they just drive over the guys? Going there. No. <laughs> I'll be able to just drive over them. So, there we go. I'm also hearing more shots. Oh. Oh, look at that. That's hostiles versus the horde. How curious. Anyway. Let's go back over. Any, any very specific thing to search? You know what? I've been meaning to search for a while. Roger. That. That main building. Orders, operator. And... Actually, no. Get this car. Waiting get it orders, back. Roger. Get it back first because we got research points when we start doing the medical centre. <laughs> like the donuts that they do at the end. <laughs> Looks like that's been repaired and this is now up as well. So we've got good defences, I think. So back in the car, and from the car, over to there. Over here, we've got three research material. So we'll bring that back too. And we want to go for um, medical care, start research. And I'm guessing we've got more people now. Scientists, let's max that. And we've got one unemployed. I could get another group. If we needed to. And they're dangerous over there. Two people that are actually very injured. The antenna is now operational. Antenna's operational. Let's broadcast an invitation as a test. Or just call the squads back to HQ. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's start broadcasting. So we're going to broadcast invite. All survivors, this is an infection-free zone. We provide food and shelter, safety and security. Receiving. Let's see what this Join does. Us. Operator. Looking for help, we're tight and endless wandering. We don't have much, but we can do a lot. Um, invite them. Please, come to us. We'll take you in. Uh, how many of them? How many of you are there? Several people, six to be precise. Address? Where are you? Oh, there you go. Hide yourselves. We'll send somebody to pick you up. Oh, that's not what I thought was going to happen. Okay, right. Um. All right, get in the car then. Cause it's getting night time. I'm going to need to go and rescue them. All right, these guys, get back in the car. We'll come back. I don't know if we can have the civilians in the car. Report, spotted. Receiving. Roger, reporting. Waiting orders. Oh dear. That's not good. <laughs> well, we're held up with the civilians. Let's just operator, operator. hope that that's going to be okay for today. <laughs> Search done. Um, <laughs> so we're still researching the med bay. Uh, we've only got one objective. It's overcast. I wonder when the next decent night's going to be where we can just do what we need to. And, um, oh yeah, they're getting closer. Oh, and then the civilians just charge out and start hacking. I mean, you have to give them, you know, well, that's courage. Courage. Not sure it's strictly necessary. Um, I'm tempted to make another, to make another squad. Sadly, one guy is still unarmed, but we do have someone that's uh, got an assault rifle, so, you know. At least there's that. We're on the move. So 
we'll move into there. And we'll defend this. So we do have another, you can have, I think it's, yes, four total of um, scavengers. That engine's turned off. It's not gonna Ford, alert anyone. Hard spotted. Where? Infected incoming. Waiting orders. Waiting orders. Reporting. Operator, ready for action. Not seeing them. Hostiles inbound. Oh, there you go. They're coming in. So these are just human. Twelve humans in King Street. Ready for action. And oh, look at the range of the Squad Three. Is that because the assault rifle? Oh yeah. That's good. <laughs> That's all fine. That's dealt with. Yeah, right, okay. So having one of those is um, very good, isn't it? <laughs> uh, we've got uh, sun up at 722. I think, to be honest, we can just get going now, really. And is there anything special to search? Oh no, there's an infected there. But it just sort of stopped. Yeah, because they're going to go inside that building now, aren't they? Oh, no. Just sort of hanging around. We are in the car, so we could do a drive-by if necessary. <laughs> Attack. I mean, we'll try. Let's do it. Just reverse. <laughs> I think they're going to hide in that, you know, that building. Yeah, they are. Okay, let's uh, let's get going then. So, operator, do you see these crowds? I've never seen such a big storm. The sky's so dark, the infected might be able to walk in the clouds' shadow during the day. We need to be vigilant. That's not what we want. So, because of the clouds, we might be attacked in the day. Yeah, that's what we needed. <laughs> All right. Well, let's go ahead and gather bricks. I'm going to gather the bricks like that, just to clear this area. And I'm going to say for that, demolish, 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 demolish. And I'm guessing the workers aren't coming out because... Basically, yeah, the, the horde, the, the hordes that can be around, potentially. We've got some more civilians coming in though, and it is all six. A little bit of an injury here and there, but hopefully not too much of a problem. From here, this vehicle. Let's search the Victorian toilets. <laughs> Why not? Why not indeed? And. What are we going to find? Ready for action. This big building, what is it? Uh, looks like some sort of residential building. No more to find. Building clear. Waiting so orders. clearing this building for the food. Food's actually all right. 24 canned food and four produced. Um, in here. Receiving. Going there. Let's Don't know why do they're it. not. Moving that over. Roger. Yeah, there you go. No, oh, is that firing I'm hearing? Roger. Operator. Roger. Don't know if it was firing or just the Let's do it. The sort of clouds and the lightning and such. Right, they they seem to be struggling with um actually picking this stuff up. Ready for action. Right, pick the food up. Are they full? No, they're, they're, there's food in there. Roger. Tin food. They just uh, apparently that they've been very they've been very picky on what they can pick up. They're not bothered about that. Hmm. How curious. We're just gonna search all these buildings around here. Ready for action. Waiting orders. And this one's almost done. It's halfway. This one's gonna be done. Waiting orders. Let's do it. Yeah, that's curious. They're not bringing stuff back. And now they're doing it. So this hard spotted. 
Could definitely walk in the day Let's then, which we did hear about. Roger. Waiting orders. Yeah, Roger. these guys are all kind of bugged on. <laughs> they're not they're not taking it out. No, they're not taking that out. Okay, that's a bit disappointing. I'm just gonna I'm gonna bring the car there. Is it because it's on the water? I mean, it's probably the case. Let's see if we get this, like, it's weird, you know, this cycle. Anyway, um, that car, I'm just going to say, just bring, just come back. Um, here, just going to keep searching. And it's actually getting dark again. All right. Are they able to finish searching? What oh, we're on, 82 percent. Let's uh, get Receiving. those hiding. You can say when does uh, the sun set, but it's A already set, B it sort of hasn't risen this entire uh, this entire day. We're on 90 percent complete. There's some hordes roaming around. I'm I'm tempted to finish off the search. We are inside the building after all. Um, no, you, you can you can go back to where you were. You don't have to go search. <laughs> They're going to go back to the little shops and search out. 95%, as soon as we're done, we'd basically load the car up and drive back. Uh, there's still some cans of food in there. We've got good ammo. We haven't got any weapons or fuel. And the resources that we can get, there's loads of buildings we can demolish. Oh, there's some tools. So... Hopefully they're going to load all this up. Which is exactly what they're doing. Yep. So, these guys. Uh, thank you for doing that. You can head back. And... Alright. These guys are now attacking the tower. So I'm going to get our assault rifle squad to come back. Oh, there's loads of them actually. Just inside the building. And are we able to Operator. take these guys out? I think so. Let's do it. I'm going to sit inside the uh, inside here. So should be able to shoot, overlook this part. No, they can't. Reporting. Can't Going move them there. up though. How is that tower doing? Oh, it's almost on half health. What type Save of horde it. is that? Just normal human horde. Okay. Fine, fine, fine. And there's some more coming down. Not too worried because of the... Yeah, that's a great line of sight. Now that we've moved all of these buildings from the front, we've got good line of sight. So not only can this tower shoot these guys, but obviously everyone in this building can do that as well. Oh, I'm hearing, re I'm hearing reloading noises. Yeah, those didn't last long. Yeah, I'm not worried about this uh, horde coming in. There we go. It's gone. We got one at the top here, but again, not concerned with that one. Operator. Just gonna keep on with this squad. And then move it as and when is needed. Minor five degrees. Hostiles inbound. Hostiles inbound again. And that's a bit of damage there. So let's repair and repair and well obviously we need to do more research more scavenging more of the same but i'm going to leave it there for now that's been a bit of infection free zone all right fair enough i'm uh i said i definitely wanted to in the previous episode do uh, the previous video do a, a follow-up just to see we're how we're getting on um things like these here that's a bit buggy uh it might be fixed uh, with subsequent patches, but who knows. If you want to see more of this sort of thing, then by all means let me know in the comments, and hope you have enjoyed this little bit of survival on a island. Hope you have enjoyed it. Thanks very much for watching. Take care, and generic partings.